Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and in this video I'm going to show you how to use the Rockstar Editor. Once you are in GTA Online, simply hold down on the D-pad and press A to start recording. If you started recording, just do some stuff that you think would be cool in a cinematic. So, just blow up some things, I blew up some cops, helicopters. If you're done, simply, again, hold down on the D-pad and save recording. You will see on the bottom left that it's saved. After that, simply go to pause menu and leave GTA Online, or just select any story mode characters. Once you've loaded into story mode, just go to pause menu, once to the left, and open up Rockstar Editor. Here you can load project, go to director mode, etc. But we are going to go to create new project. Here we can add clip, add radio track, score track, etc. But we are going to use add clip. As you can see here are our clips by data, by name and by size. I usually go by date. So just click add clip and then edit clip. Basically all you have to do is click A like 8 times once you are in Rockstar Editor. When you're in your clip you can see your timeline. Here you can play it, go cycle, scrub fine, scrub, go back and you can even take a snapmatic but uh, we actually need a marker so we can use different camera angles and stuff so yes so go ahead and add the marker here you can see yeah, cameras, effects, audio etc but we go to cameras and I usually set it to free camera so I can move around Once you place two cameras, you can go to blend mode and use smooth transi transitioning. If you want to add more clips, just go back and back again and go to add clip, clips by date and add the clip. That's that simple. Select the clip, press A and you can select where to place it before the other clip or after the other clip.
When you're done editing, you can hide the timeline by pressing the right stick on Xbox. Then play the clips and record them with Xbox Live. Just download them and import them to your editing software. And here's our final product. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below and have a great day.